defense. Tops in the league, although a miss pass here, and it looks like JMU trying to counter. Onto the left foot, the shot just wide. 25 yards out, Morgan Nanny to take it. Nanny. Upper 90! The Seahawks take a 1-0 lead. Very dangerous positioning right outside the 18, and Morgan Nanny stepped up to the plate. She saw the opportunity that was given to her, and she decided to place the shot on frame. Crawford versus Snyder. And it's Crawford. Not by much, though. Sydney Snyder guessing the right way. She dove towards her left, and that's exactly where Crawford put it. Snyder. She works her way into the midfield all the way back. Gordon stepping up. Crawford trying to turn, finds Deal. Deal, right foot to the left, the shot just over the bar. Playing the ball at her feet and being loud back there, encouraging her teammates and being a leader for them. Cross that's whipped in, oh, it just sneaks past Nanny. Now a rebound shot and it's over the bar. UNCW head coach Chris Neal said his team got addicted to shutouts. Oh, dangerous opportunity and JMU! Takes a 2-1 lead. Check out their competition. Dangerous deal on the near sideline, 1v1. Draws another defender, crosses in. Oh, man, what a finish. I think that was Sarah Gordon on the finish for the Dukes. Instead of seven, it's 17. Oh, uh, 17, that's it. Maya Foley. On the far side. From the right flank, that one just crossed in front of the net. Bunch of bodies that are denying shots and finally it goes out of bounds. That that's exactly right, James Madison. Put the pressure on early in this second half and they haven't Ten, let up since. Nine. Last chance eight, for Harding. Seven. And she'll make this score look pretty. Audrey Harding with a left footed shot at the top of the 18. There are seven seconds left on the clock. It was the Dukes two, who came out hands. victorious. We'll six, Three Bannon goals to two. Harding with a goal to finish it off. But James Madison scores a pair of goals at the start of the second half to secure this victory.